day two of uh, <clears throat> coronavirus here, and I'm playing around with this um, ISD1820 board that I've gotten. Um, this is a small uh, recorder board, and so just to be clear, it comes with you know just a cheap little speaker and also a kind of bogus microphone. Um, that didn't work really well, so I kind of wrote this off. What I was doing is I was gonna use this potentially for a uh, like a small guitar looper pedal project. Not even a pedal, just some kind of functionality, looping functionality. It only records about 10 seconds, but I was concerned about the quality when I was using, you know, the microphone that was supplied and also um, that tiny little speaker. So what I did is I unsoldered it. And I've got this little mono eighth inch plug with screw terminals that go into the board where the microphone uh, was soldered in. And then I just, you know, threw on a speaker as well. This is a three inch speaker I'm uh, using for a separate project that I'm also working on while I'm kind of out here. And so what I did is I just played in some music, some royalty-free music, just hear how it sounds with the larger speaker. And going right in, I didn't take any of the resistors or anything off, just going right in out of there. And I was actually kind of impressed. So I think the duration is going to work. I think it's about 10 seconds. It seems to almost be... Maybe a little bit longer than that, and the uh, quality is also better than I thought. I think I'd, for this other project I'm doing, I think I'll probably still amplify it, maybe with something small like uh, an LM386, or maybe that PAM uh, 8403 board or something, but I think it will work for the project I had in mind. Um, so again, just uh, something to keep in mind if you're messing around with these. It was absolutely atrocious using the supplied microphone and this little speaker. So just an idea. Hope all is well. Take care, everybody.